Well, Pfizer has announced its COVID-19 vaccine is 100% effective and well tolerated for children ages 12 to 15. And many doctors say this is exactly the news they wanted to hear. Fox 2's Kelly Hoskins is live outside SSM Health Cardinal Glennon Children's Hospital tonight with the developments. Kelly. Well, Sandy, health experts here at SSM Cardinal Glenn and Children's Hospital say that Pfizer's announcement is a significant step in turning back the pandemic. Pfizer says its COVID-19 vaccine is safe and 100% effective in preventing the illness in pre-teenagers and teens ages 12 through 15. A Pfizer hopes to start vaccinating children before the next school year. Medical Director of Disaster Preparedness at SSM Health Cardinal Glenn and Children's Hospital says the news is encouraging. It's really exciting to hear that the vaccine so far is um, incredibly effective in our adolescent population. It's not something that is a huge surprise. We knew that the vaccine's already very effective in our adult population, um, but it's extremely good news to know that we have that same effectiveness and even better in our children. Pfizer plans to request emergency use authorization in the coming weeks, according to Pfizer, in a phase three trial of more than 2,200 young teenagers in the U.S. About half got the real shot, while the other got a placebo shots. Dr. Rachel Charney studied the test results. And half of them got the vaccine. And what they found is that uh, there were cases of COVID in the group that got the placebo, uh, but those who had the actual vaccine, no one got has gotten COVID up to this point that they've been following the children. Dr. Alex Garza with the St. Louis Metropolitan Pandemic Task Force in Wednesday's media briefing says the study shows promising news. And what it showed is in their studies from, 50, from 12 to 15 year old that it's extremely effective and even more so than, than in adults. Um, so they did not find any infections among children who received vaccine in their most recent clinical trial and it produced a strong antibody response and there no real serious side effects. Well, Pfizer will submit its adolescent plan to the U.S. Food Drug Administration for authorization. It's unclear how long the FDA will take to review the request. Live in St. Louis, Kelly Hoskins, Fox 2 News.